Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name's Noelle and I review and unbox subscription boxes here on my channel and today I am so excited to finally get to share with you the June or the Summer Do Good Paper Co. subscription box that's been sent to me for review. So subscribers do receive beautifully decorated boxes. This time around we have this nice big rainbow tape and a raffia bow. I just love all of those details. I think it's so special. It really makes receiving your box three times a year seem like an event to truly savor and enjoy and that's what we're gonna try to do here but let me tell you some of the details so essentially it is $59 for a one-time box plus shipping and she is shipping from Canada but you can definitely get it here in the States obviously and then if you are able to you can do an annual subscription and again it's just three times a year I believe it's in February June and October and that brings the price down to $55 per box plus shipping now I do have a code for you for a little extra savings it's noel five off so noel the number five off and that will save you five dollars whether or not you're doing a one-time box or the subscription again i highly suggest the subscription if you can do it so you can get this beautiful decoration on your box that goes with the theme so let me just give you some other details about it so it says you always get two full-size products from the season's new notebook collection because they do a lot of their own designs which i just think are so beautiful and if you want to get a feel for do good paper co, co you can definitely check out their website and they show you all the different collections so it could be to uh, it could be spiral journals, uh, notebooks, diaries. Sometimes designed in collaboration with a local artist, which I think is awesome. And then there's going to be three to five coordinating items. Sometimes these are more lifestyle items. Sometimes they're other stationery or desk accessory goods. Carefully curated to complement the notebooks and enhance the creative or writing experience for the subscriber. Most products are procured from local small businesses. And the reason for the name of the company, of course, Do Good Paper Co. is that a portion of box sales is donated to charity so subscribers know their purchases are meaningful so here is what it looks like on the interior of course I'm gonna grab that product card so it tells us a little bit more and the theme this time around is a mindful summer so I feel like that definitely goes with anything where we're doing some journaling and then it's just a fold out sheet that's going to tell me all of the information so I can share all of that with you. So it says summer always feels so short when you're having a good time or when it's busy. It's easy to forget to take in each moment to be truly mindful and present. That is why we've created this very special subscription box themed a mindful summer. The items inside make it easy for you to have a way to always reconnect with yourself and your environment this summer, whether you're staying in town or escaping to different places. We worked very closely with a brilliant yoga and meditation teacher, Tanya Porter, to bring you an exclusive special edition of her new book ahead of its official launch. How cool. It says this will hopefully become a powerful journal practice and your go-to self-care exercise. As always, a portion of subscription box sales will be donated to, to 10,000 trees to help plant new trees and restore natural habitat, which of course we think is a fantastic uh, cause and organization to support, especially being a uh, paper company. So it says, oh, she actually has her own unboxing with Leslie, which I did take a peek at because I was very curious about the contents. Maybe you already caught it, but I have to tell you guys before we get started, at time of filming, and I just got the box the other day, there were only eight boxes left because that's how popular this subscription is and how wonderful the products are. So if you're watching this and you get through it and you're like, wow, I absolutely need that box. What a great value. What a great uh, thing to incorporate into my summer plans. Then get on it right now. Okay. So looks like we have five items total. So we have, of course, their little sticker that says that they were a uh, winner of a year of boxes for Bre best craft and stationary box, which we love to hear. We, of course, have our own awards as well, the Nobody Awards, which we are planning on doing once again this year. So I'm sure that... Uh, do Good Paper Company will be in contention for Best Stationery Box for us as well because honestly, I don't open that many here on the channel, do I? All right, guys, let me see if I can get in there. Nice, thick tissue paper. Okay. So one item is kind of hiding everything else, but I will give you a quick look at it. So it is a branded item. Now, I'm not usually, to be all in 
all honesty, super into a lot of branded items by any subscription box. If it's done in a subtle and sort of elegant, sophisticated way, then I don't mind so much. And I definitely trust Do Good Paper Company for that aspect in terms of, you know, having really nice neutral color palettes when, when appropriate. And that seems to be the case with our little branded tote, which has a value of $12. It's kind of a different tote size. So it's a little bit more narrow. So not necessarily that classic, like kind of like 12 by 12 or 14. 14 by 14 size but it is nice that it's got these um, doubled uh, straps here you can see and it's kind of a thicker canvas uh, than some of the ones probably like a cotton I'm guessing it says carry all these items in this perfectly sized canvas bag that is made of untreated organic calico cotton in a natural beige color and again it says that it has a value of $12 um, so it, it does say do good paper co but again their their branding their logo is pretty simple not too crazy in terms of looking like like advertisement um, and you know if you wanted to you could decorate the other side if you're like into fabric painting or what have you but it is kind of unique in terms of the size and shape of it it's just a little bit like I said narrower than I'm used to seeing for a little tote all right so I do see another item that's not a paper good but I want to go ahead and get to some of the paper stuff in here for us so we have it says look sharp always sharp graphite pencil and eraser Ooh, that's cool that there's an eraser component to it so this is what that looks like so maybe i'll open this up it says this is the pencil that you'll want to take everywhere with you because it never needs sharpening and it's compressed graphite tip equals 100 pencils that's so awesome so it's sealed on both ends let me see if i can find the path of least resistance where there's only one sticker instead of two it says use it for your drawing breaths practice so that's a little spoiler for one of our other items or for summer doodles and it has a value of $13.50 so let me see okay so this is kind of cool it almost feels like getting like a calligraphy set or something so I guess that's like a refill oh no that's the eraser so <laughs> I was like what is this um so this is the eraser it's kind of a cool shape let me see if I can pull this out so it's like this uh, triangular eraser. It almost looked like a big piece of graphite to me. And then this is really pretty for a graphite pencil. Let's see. It's very elegant because, you know, I used to have those when you took like art class, those like drawing ones, and they were great, but they were very messy. So look how cool that is, you guys. It's got this point and then it just works like a regular pencil. That's so neat. And I think you just uh, twist it to, in, uh, to add to the tip. So... Yeah, so it says keep pencil capped when not in use to protect the graphite tip. So I guess this cap comes off the end. There we go. And then we just cap it like that. But look how pretty that is in the gray. Hopefully I didn't, yeah. So <laughs> I was like, hopefully I didn't unscrew it too much. But I love the two-tone gray with the gold accents. That's totally me right there. That's like my color palette right there. So I think that's so cool. So you must just um, screw it so that it like gets sharper at the end. So interesting. Very cool though. All right, so we did mention Drawing Breath. So this is the book uh, that she worked with, with Tanya Porter to create, creator of Rhythmic Reframing. So it's kind of cool. It looks like the uh, old school book covers that you used to make for your textbooks. Remember you guys, when you would take the, the paper grocery bags and unfold them and then make your book covers? It's kind of got that vibe to it, which I think is kind of neat. But so it says a seven step daily self-care journal practice. Interesting, it says the Drawing Breath's journal practice is a comprehensive and repeatable system that guides you with prompts to deepen your relationship with your ever evolving self. You will meditate with your breath while drawing and writing as a do good paper company subscription box member you are receiving an exclusive special edition copy that opens flat has a hard cover and dust jacket and as well as a ribbon bookmark so we have this black ribbon bookmark down here the retail value is 35 dollars so it says it has the lay foot lay flat binding which of course is so important for a journal especially if you're going to be drawing and doing a lot of writing so it does look like there is quite a bit of space for you to do kind of like short answers though which you guys know i I am a proponent of because I, I don't necessarily like a blank one. It's got a lot of info, so definitely some um, yoga influence here in terms of the five observances of cleanliness, acceptance, practice, self-study, and trust sort of changed into a more Western uh, terminology, so interesting. So it does definitely give you some reading. 
Cool. All right, so it says this process is a comprehensive and repeatable system that guides you through seven consecutive exercises. The structure is simple, immediate, and has a direct effect. By simply following the prompts, you will show yourself that you are present for yourself, raising your sense of self and raising your sense of self-worth. So basically, there's like this like sort of drawing part where you can trace it with your finger or the graphite pencil, and then you write and you say, I am here. So that's your presence, right? You're taking breaths as you actually do the motions of the drawing. I am listening. You talk about physically and emotionally. I am noticing. I am open to learning and growing. I allow myself to say no to self and others. I allow myself to say yes. And seven is I create my future. So it probably prompts you and explains how you use these different sections each time. So I think that I saw in Leslie's unboxing that this should last you about uh, three months. So you can see there's some here where there's no drawing and you're probably um, doing your own kind of doodle or something, for example. Hmm. Um, so, uh, and your own kind of breath practice as you learn how to draw breath, literally drawing breath in and out, but also drawing with your hands so you have that tactile experience. So basically by the time uh, you've gotten through this and used all three months worth of pages, then it should be available online for you to get another one. And how cool would that be to just have a bunch of them stacked up like for the year, like say you committed to doing this for a full year um, and seeing how that affected your life. That's cool. So. I think it's neat that she did a collaboration. You guys know I'm not like a big journaler, but I will do my best. I will give it a, a give it a try. So it just says the system is especially helpful if you want to cultivate a supportive space for growth within yourself, but aren't sure where to begin or have trouble maintaining a regular practice. So that would definitely definitely be me. So I love the prompts and I love the idea of you know summer can get so busy, but it is really nice to be able to not just take all those photographs on your phone that you might not ever look at but actually take some time to journal because that is one of the most um, exciting things about experiences is being able to reflect on them to create memories and you can definitely make it part of a sense of self-study as well as just going out and having fun right and how nice to be able to savor it and see what you uh, learned and how you grew over that three month period all right, so here is our journal, like our more traditional do good paper coat journal. And it's really pretty in this gray. So it almost looks like suede, but it doesn't actually, you know, when you rub your hands over, it doesn't change the brush of the material. So it's a faux vegan leather, I'm assuming. It says it has a retail value of $22. This classic journal has a vintage look and feel on its cover and has been a staple to many customers. So I feel like this is one of their, you know, first products that they probably had. It says use it as an extension to the Drying Breaths journal or as a place to record your summer writing or memories. So if, for example, you went through this and it wasn't available yet online, you could use those same seven prompts in your blank journal. Um, or you could just make it your summer journal if you are someone who's a little bit more prolific with your writing than I am. Gray is the default color included in the box, but subscribers also had the option to choose brown for like a more natural leather color. But you guys know me, I love my gray and it looks really pretty with the pen, the graphite uh, pencil, excuse me. So let's see what it looks like like on the interior it's really kind of cool it's got these like brown edges to it so that is neat and then inside it's just like wide ruled pretty pretty wide ruled which is kind of nice if you have a bigger script and it does have a little space for the date and then it looks like it's got not one but two ribbon bookmarks and we have it in brown and gray so it's going to match regardless of the color of cover that you chose so that's kind of nice as well if you have multiple subjects for example and it also has this nice elastic closure so that was kind of hidden in the back so that is our notebook so instead of necessarily getting two full-size products from the season's new notebook collection we actually got this really cool collaboration which is kind of a notebook right it's a journal as well as the notebook then you already saw the branded tote and the graphite pencil and uh, by the way the graphite pencil had a value of 1350 if I didn't mention it finally we are finishing with something that is not paper related it's a macrame rainbow now I've actually done one of these myself in a craft kit and I had a really good time doing it, it was very meditative uh, once you got the hang of it but this of course is done like by a professional they gave us a nice long cord so you could hang this you know on your rear view mirror you could hang it in your window I love the very neutral color palette it's very on trend 
trend, very kind of bohemian aesthetic there. It says this cute custom made rainbow was handmade by a Canadian small business, The Simple Shop. Hang it on your office wall, in your car, or on your bag. Ooh, I like that as a like on your big tote, for example. It'd be really cute on like a big like straw basket, I think. It says, as a reminder to take a deep breath during a busy or rough day because what appears after the rain, those difficult moments in your life or your day, and the retail value on this is $12. So while we're at it, as with this nice little reminder, um, nice little sort of cap, I feel like, to this curation of a mindful summer, Let's have a secret password. So it's going to be rainbow today. Now, if you are newer to my channel, we do these secret password giveaways every single month. And when you come across a secret password, you want to enter it along with your contact information in the Google form that is linked for you in the description box below, but also again, usually in the pinned comment. Please don't leave the secret password in the comments because I have to delete it. The whole idea is that you're listening, you're watching, you're finding those secret passwords. Each secret password, and there's usually 10 to 12 per month, is an entry. At the end of the month, actually about five days into the following month, I use a secret number, a random number picker, to select a few winners to receive mystery boxes with some of the items that I receive in boxes as my way of saying thank you, as my way of sharing all of the awesome products that I receive and get to review with all of you. You do have to be a subscriber of my channel. It doesn't have to be publicly. I can confirm with you via email. You have to have a U.S. or Canadian mailing address. And the Canadians, I do need a little help with the shipping because it does take me a lot more time in terms of having to fill out the forms and it's just a little bit more costly. But there's also the option to just get a gift card. Know that. You do have to be 18 years or older. And I do want to remind you that it is not affiliated with YouTube or any of the boxes that I open here on the channel. It is just my way of saying thank you. If you are still confused about it, please feel free to ask in the comments for more instruction, but without actually putting the password in there. Again, I just have to delete those so that it's fair for everyone so that you're not just giving away the secret passwords and then everybody gets to go ahead and enter it in the form. Or you could ask over in the Nobot Nook, which is our private Facebook group, and someone would be happy to help and explain it to you. But again, just please don't put it into the comments. I would truly, truly appreciate that. All right, guys, so our secret password for today in our June secret password giveaway is rainbow in honor of this adorable macrame rainbow that came in our Do Good Paper Co. subscription box for June, which let's go over all of the cool stuff that we got. So this is kind of the hero item, I would say. Our Drawing Breaths 7-Step Daily Self-Care Journal Practice that allows you to get kind of creative, but also kind of helps guide you on a consistent journaling practice to really create memories and growth through your summer. We got our Faux Vegan Leather Journal. And again, if you're a subscriber, you would get to choose the color. Again, remember, there's only a few of these boxes still available, but you could probably find that product as a one-off in the shop as well. We got our Look sharp graphite pencil so they did kind of hyphenate that because I think it kind of works like a little bit of a finer line than those traditional graphite pencils that you get with an eraser which I love our macrame rainbow this is my favorite item in all honesty it's just so gosh darn cute and well executed compared to the time that I tried doing it and our branded tote that just says do good paper co so I'm just going to show you kind of the size of it so it's really perfect for just like whatever you might be reading your journal maybe if you have like a little watercolor kit that you like to take with you and of course these are always great to have with you in your larger purse or tote because you might get some other exciting things along the way in your day. It's also a really kind of nice way to protect your journals and books uh, to give it that added layer of protection within a larger tote. So you guys, let me know what you thought about this collection. Did you already scoop it up? I hope that you did because now we have like until fall to wait for the next collection. If you haven't already, definitely check out some of their beautiful collections over on their website. And again, you can save $5 on a one-time box or the annual subscription description of three boxes using the code NOEL5OFF and I'll leave that all for you below. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you all very very soon in my next unboxing.